Desert Rose and Bloom is the missions outreach arm of Emily Rose Lewis Ministries. And aside from supporting um, an orphanage in Uganda, we also feed widows, orphans, and the those who are extremely impoverished in India. And we are working with a minister and his wife there um, to open a school. We've actually already broken ground and we've uh, Hopefully it will be up and running by June 17th when school starts back. And there's going to be many, many children who have never been to school. Eight, 10 year olds, 12 year olds, never ever had an opportunity to go to school. That will be able to go to school because of um, the generous donations of our friends and partners. We also are building a hostel, which is like a boarding school slash orphanage for the children who don't have family to come and stay and have an opportunity to get education. And so we are so grateful for all of our friends and partners. This is uh, the body of Christ practicing true religion, which is to take care of widows and orphans in their distress. And and so we're just being the, the hands of feet in Jesus and, and through the relationships that are being formed and built through those who have, are coming alongside of us we have a huge, huge vision to ourselves uh, go over um, to Africa because we, we support an orphanage in Uganda, but we really have a goal to go to Kenya and, um, and build there. But right now we are focusing on building here in Herndon, Virginia at Kingdom Living Ecclesia and Academy and just, you know, raising up men and women of God here to um, really shake this region for the kingdom. So we, we just appreciate you all so much and wanted to share a little bit with you about um, what it means to us and what we're able to do through the partnerships and the gifts um, of those who support the ministry. We are in Odisha. As you all know that because of COVID-19, India is locked down and we are trying to do small things for the needy people. So uh, we had in our heart, but we didn't have like a mom, but we were praying but uh, so that God provided those things to give them. God bless us to bless to others. So we are so much happy and thankful to God that he provided it. And today evening we are decided to distribute these things to 200 families. So this is here and I hope this is enough for them and we're so much happy and please pray for us so that we can do more things in coming days for the people and for this community also. We have lots of desire. Please pray for our ministry also and for everything. Thank you so much.